Yeah, hello here. Look at this, or I better listen to this because this is here my Mazda 3 radio, and there is no audio out coming out today. Uh, so no matter what I'm trying to play here, AM, FM, CD, satellite, nothing works. Um, well, actually, the button still it seems still to work, and there's uh, just some light crackling coming out of the speakers when you change the volume. Um, but also, like the CD changer, for example, doesn't work at all. I can't like select any CDs. Uh, but I can ch select here the channels for FM or an AM. But everything else doesn't seem to work at all. So how do we fix this? So first I take a look here at my handbook. I'm looking for the fuse for the radio. And this says here, fuse 7.5 amps, number 44. It's located here at the spot and the fuse panel here is in the passenger compartment down there underneath the glove box just go there let's have a quick look here is like this plastic cover that you have to pull off first it's a little bit tricky it's just clamped in so there's no screws or anything you just pull it out just pull it down basically i'm just trying to do this here with one hand that's a little bit tricky but uh, it's basically held in here with two plastic tabs and you just pull this out, pull this down and eventually it pops off. So then you have here the fuse panel and you're just going to open this up. You can fold this down here right, after loosening those two clips there. And then here you have the fuse panel and number 44, that's here, the second one to the left. That's the seven and a half amp fuse. Yeah. So this is confirmed. Also, if you take a look at this, at the plastic cover that you just took off, there's also again here the layout of the fuses. So we just turn this around and then you see here on the top row here, second one to the left, seven and a half, seven and a half amp radio. So this is the right one. And you want to pull this one out. And so either you use like this fuse pulling out tool, which doesn't come with this fuse panel, or you just take some pliers pull them out and now I'm going to double check here that this was really the right fuse and you can already see here the radio is dead now so this was the correct fuse and I'm going to let this sit here I'm not just going to pull like this back in right away I'm going to wait maybe three to five minutes so that the radio really shuts down completely and now I am going to uh, just put the fuse back in and then let us have a look at if this did anything okay so you just plug it back in and let's have a look okay so the power is back and as soon as i push the button here you can already you look at this everything or at least the volume is back so music is back we have sound again yeah am fm works and the cd changer also seems to be back alive so yeah this was already it. This was the easy fix how to do this. Yeah, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to check out my other Mazda 3 repair videos.